ValleySpace is a browser-based data-driven systems engineering tool that provides a single source of truth for your engineering project. Manage relevant highlights of your system design with custom dashboards to see it as soon as you open the project. Using the Components module, organize the physical and virtual parts of your system within the Components tree. Store design data, relations and custom models using Valleys. Using the Requirements module, define and connect the requirements with the components. Track and verify the requirements of the changing system design using the Verifications tab. With the Analysis module, create dynamic documents that inherit design data. Include figures, budgets and quantities that update automatically with the design change. AGI's SDK is a proven digital mission engineering platform that brings together high fidelity models, geometry and dynamics for mission design and analysis. Customize, build and visualize every part of your mission with a comprehensive set of advanced SDK modules. Now, with the ValleySpace integration plugin in SDK, enable digital continuity between your systems and mission models throughout the life cycle. Let's see how that works. Click on the ValleySpace plugin toolbar button and log in with your ValleySpace account. The plugin loads all the supported values of the SDK objects in the current scenario. Here, we have a scenario with a geo transfer design, a LEO satellite, and a ground station whose attribute values are available in the plugin. To connect this to your system's data on ValleySpace, open the project settings and enter the name of your ValleySpace project. Once loaded, the project tree appears in the right pane of the plugin with all components and valleys. Connect the SDK attributes to valleys by selecting the attribute row and a valley from the project tree. Let's bind this dry mass of my spacecraft in SDK to the dry mass under satellite and mass props in the ValleySpace project tree. On binding, the plugin checks for values and units of the connected attributes. This binding is marked in yellow whenever values between the system and the mission model are not in sync. Connect all your variables between the tools and save these bindings to preserve these connections and persist throughout the design lifecycle. The Dataset tab in the plugin allows you to export time dynamic datasets from the mission design to your systems design in Valley Space. Choose from tens of thousands of mission related quantities like illumination, range, and angles and bind them to your system's data in value space with custom time properties. Once these bindings are configured, they are preserved and can be restored. With the power of digital continuity, enable faster design changes and reconfigurations. Let's change these orbit parameters of the parking orbit in value space. Go back to the plugin and refresh the value space data. We see that we restore all the bindings and the changed attributes are marked in yellow. With the check selection, take these changed orbit parameters into the SDK environment with the Update SDK button. The SDK scenario is immediately updated with all the values. We see the parking orbit change reflected in our astrogator configuration here. Run the astrogator mission sequence to calculate the new transfer trajectory using the configured differential correctors to target the desired geo slot. On finishing the calculations, evaluate the new trajectory and apply the changes. Here, we see the satellite achieving its designated geo slot following the rapid recalculations for the changed parking orbit. In the plugin, the new delta V values are now reflected and marked in yellow, demanding sync. Select the delta V attributes and take them back to the value space project data with update value button. Once updated, the new values are available immediately to all the project members in ValleySpace. We see that all the latest data V values of each maneuver are now available and the total data V is automatically being calculated. The values automatically update all the values that are defined using them. For instance, Luis, who is a propulsion systems engineer, defines a dynamic relation to calculate the wet mass of the satellite using the delta V values from the mission design. The sweat mass is updated automatically. Luis can then quickly check if the new design violates any of the system requirements. The violation of a requirement rule is shown and we find that in the current design of the wet mass, it's over the 1000 kg limit, which can now be noticed and tackled immediately. When all the attributes are synced, there are no yellow marked bindings in the plugin anymore. Similar to the attributes, dataset bindings are also preserved. Here we have several mission-related datasets bound to the respective dataset values. 
select the datasets and use the Generate and Update button to generate the dataset from the SDK engine and push it to the ValueSpace project. After the background calculations have finished, we have the updated mission datasets available in ValueSpace. Here we have the sun declination angle for a defined time interval generated in SDK. ValueSpace also automatically creates a visual representation using dataset graphs. Similarly, we have lightning duration, eclipse duration, and access times to the ground station per orbit in a day. Simon, who is a power subsystem engineer, uses the eclipse duration in his custom battery model to calculate the required optimum battery capacity. He uses the average of datasets to define a nominal battery capacity and adds margins. To enable quick interpretation, he changes the unit to get the capacity in that hour in no time. On the other side of the continent, Marco, who is a telecommunication engineer, accesses the same project and uses the station access duration to calculate average expected data volume in his telemetry model, making the new values immediately available to everyone else. Marco, Luis and Simon and all the stakeholders can rest assured that the system's design is in sync with the latest mission model with the help of the Valley Space and SDK integration, which makes rocket science a lot more efficient.